Yo, 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 what's going on, y'all? Fairly had these on here. Um, this is not a filter. My daughter's put these, uh, like, Kat Von D stars on there. I think I'm gonna get a face tattoo. Uh, I said I would get a face tattoo when I, uh, decided that I never want to go back to a job again. And people like, no, don't do that. I was like, I'm serious. I want to make myself, like, completely unemployable. Uh, Pat, I just saw your fucking text. I'm just getting back to messages today. I'm gonna message you back in a minute. Um, so... I was just watching, Alex, I just saw your fucking messages too from yesterday. I was on calls all night, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm going to hit you back too. So, Gary Vee was just on Facebook Live, which hasn't been on in a while. So, I wanted to communicate what he communicate and how that resonates with me because I know y'all aren't watching that. Y'all are stuck on trying to figure out what your damn niches are and all this bullshit with your business. So, the three, the three components of content. Speed, quantity, and quality. Speed, quantity, and quality. Speed, quantity, and quality. Speed and quantity are completely controllable. How much you put out content, whether you're documenting content, whether you're putting stuff out all day on your personal pages, on wherever. And the third is quality. Quality is subjective, okay? If you get stuck on quality and you're spending too much time in production or thought or overthinking things, then you don't put things out and it delays the other two. So focus on the other two. Yeah, you have to have a, a minimum amount of quality in what you do, but focus on those two. Speed and quantity. Put out a ton of shit in a lot of time. Share yourself. No, At no point has the attention span for attention been any shorter than it is right now. So once you have people's attention, you have to continue to keep their attention by putting out shit, putting out content, putting out things of value. Not crap, but putting out things of value. Um, and with that, it doesn't always have to be something pertainable to what your business is. It doesn't always have to be something that has an ROI on making money. You want to develop no like and trust with people? Share your life. Share what you like. Oh, I like, you know, I wa like watching the Premier League. Oh, I like eating pizza. Oh, Bosa Donuts in Phoenix, Arizona is the shit. Share what you do. Share your life. Document your life. Share and document different aspects of your life. It doesn't always have to be pertaining to the business and it doesn't always have to be content related. And if all you do is sell shit and you're not adding value, nobody's going to like you. Okay? If you're Apple, you can just sell shit all the time because you already have a reputation. Everybody loves you already. Well, most people. Half, half the population does. The other half waste their time with fucking androids and all that bullshit. Anyways. Um, so, yeah. Speed, quantity, and quality. Quality is subjective. The other two are not. So put out tons of shit a lot and document. This is what Facebook Stories is for. This is what Instagram Stories is for. This is what Snapchat is for. That's why these platforms are so successful because you can just share shit. It doesn't always have to be pertaining to the, 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 the thing that you do to your business or whatever. Your personality is part of it. If I was concerned about just being... Uh, a professional, I wouldn't show up with fucking little makeup tattoos on my face or do filters or talk the way I do or anything, but I'm not concerned with professionalism or my image. I'm concerned with showing up real and authentic and showing you guys who I am and being frequent. Okay, you guys can count on the fact that I'm going to show up every day. And if you're wondering why your business isn't doing well, it's because you're not showing up every day. You're not showing up everywhere. Not adding enough value. So the three things that are controllable, again, Speed, quantity, and quality. Quality, minimal. That's the least important. Maybe, this isn't the way it used to be where the, the means of production, the means of dissemination are controllable by other people. We've, we've taken out the middleman. There's not broad, you know, there's not networks who are going to decide, okay, your show's quality, I'm going to put it on. There isn't that anymore. Social media, it's... it's me to you, me to you, me to you, you to your audience. So you have to continue to put out content consistently with speed and lots of it all the time. And that is how you build your brand. That's how you build everything. And when you build know, like, and trust, not through just showing what um, pertains to your business or trying to make sales on, but just showing your life, documenting who you are. People would rather do business with somebody that they know, like, and trust because they relate to them in some way, because they understand them, just because they like you, then maybe even someone who's more qualified to help them than you are. But that's just, yes, human nature. You have to understand human behavior. So put yourself out there. Speed and quantity over quality all day. 
and show up. You should be all over every platform that you need to be. Um, people ask, oh, should I be on Facebook or should I be on Instagram? Should I be on Snap? Should I be on Twitter? Yes, all of them. Every fucking one of them. And show up on there. Um, my wife is kind of blowing up right now. Uh, I don't know if you guys have seen this, but she just got uh, a published interview in Huffington Post. It's fucking amazing. But it's a result of showing up and showing up on all of her platforms consistently. And when she made that shift, when she made that commitment to showing up, things fucking shifted. So, fucking show up. Show yourself. Put yourself out there. Thanks, Darren. Appreciate you, brother. Uh, it was absolutely my honor to help you guys. You guys are amazing. So, I fucking love y'all. Have a good night. I think we're going to go live in a little while. Courtney and I, we're going to talk about some things. So, oh, we are, she says. Yes, we are. So, love you guys. Talk to you later. Uh, Alex, you're still on. I'm going to hit you up. Uh, and Pat, if you're on, I'm going to hit you up too. Anna, good job. All right. Talk to you guys later. Bye.